to create a MySQL database, click on this icon over here. Now basically you will need this MySQL database to use with a third party script to be installed on your server. So to first the first step to do this is to go to this field over here and create the database name. It can be anything that you want. For example, it can be test1. Then click on the create database here. Next, the second step is to create a user. Scroll down. create a new user for example the username test with the password test gain password test and optionally you can also use this generate password button to for the system to generate password for you then click on create user so this is the second step once you have done that go back and now you need to integrate or add the database to the user. Scroll down. Find the user. Because I already have my own user before this. This is why in the drop down box there is more than one. So find the user here, Amir test. And find the database. Which is Amir test 1. Then click on the add button over here. This will integrate the user and the database. Then over here, click on check on this box, all privileges. And click on this button, make changes. And there you go, now it has been added. So now the database username is called Amir underscore test. The database name is called Amir underscore test one and the password is the password which you created just now let's go back and you can find over here there are many database and these are examples of my own database which I use for each of the script that like you see here ad tracks it is a third party ad tracking script okay so basically the number of database that you can have will be limited by your web hosting provider so you must check with your web hosting provider on how many database uh, do, uh, do they allow you to have on your account so basically that's all and if you want to delete the database just click on this delete button and if you want to delete the user just click on this user button again if you want to delete the user entirely can click on this button or this button.